How you doing, everybody? Welcome back to Dreamfall Chapters. I almost said the longest journey. This is the uh, the newer one. Uh, out here on Nancy Gaming. So in the last episode, our introduction episode, uh, we are Zoe Castillo. We are stuck in story time. And we are now going back, apparently, Zoe. Uh, you are about to come out of your coma. So, yeah. Uh, my apologies for the last episode where I kind of didn't talk during the conversation between um, Zoe and the Vagabond. Um, I ended up having my parents come home earlier than I expected, and so I wasn't really able to talk. But I wanted the conversation uh, to still, you guys to still hear the conversation and everything. So, anyway, how exactly are we going to get back? Do we go into Zoe's mind? Is that what we're going to have to do? Um... Okay. If I'm ever going to find a way out of this place, that's my doorway. Me. Yeah, we had that mind power thing, so let's, uh... Yeah, I think we have to go into her mind. Let's see if I that works. I tried reading my own mind once. The feedback loop was nasty. I kept bouncing around my own head like... Like a reflection in a hall of mirrors. The... I don't know what you'd call it signal from my comatose brain it's too weak it's getting drowned out by my waking thoughts to tap into my subconscious i'd have to somehow boost the signal and turn down the volume on my conscious mind what what does that even mean okay is there something here we can do this is probably a terrible idea but if i can adjust the mixture of drugs going into my veins I might be able to give my brain a chemical jolt, boost the subconscious signal. Don't know if it'll okay. work or just kill me, but beggars, choosers. Thing is, I can't push any buttons from in here. That machine is out there, in the physical world. I don't think my dreaming powers extend that far unless... Unless I can somehow affect the state of things that are mirrored in here. What? I don't understand what you just said. Okay, mind power? That thing doesn't have any conscious thoughts. Okay, no, that's apparently a no. Uh, slow down time. Oh. Oh, bollocks, the machine's going nuts. Oh, I feel really weird. The machine's gone haywire. It's pumping a uh -oh. crazy Did amount I make of drugs a into my body. I just wanted a little pick-me-upper, not an actual OD. Now what? Now what? Now okay. what? Okay, so magic machine is working overtime, pumping a scary amount of drugs into my okay. system. Okay, now do we go? So, okay, the cocktail of industrial strength chemicals the machine has injected into my body is boosting the subconscious signal. Oh, so we were supposed to do that, but okay. But now, oh, it's too fast. Too jarring, like like a train of thought going at the speed of light. I can't get a good grip on it. Too jarring, okay. Um can't get a grip on it. Going too fast. Uh what do we can we Wonkers. My old what Can we use him for anything? No? Okay. Um 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 What did we what did we do uh, when we did this? I'm thinking this could turn out to be a very bad thing. Yeah, me too. And we apparently can't do anything else with it. Okay. Uh let's try slowing down time on this. Did that work? We good? We good now? Now can we do it? Oh, okay. Where do you think you're going? Did oh. you think it was going to be that easy? A quick chat with Mr. Dinner Theater and then sayonara to story time. Hello, second chances. Don't be a fucking tosser. You're staying here with me, doing the only thing we're good at. Being dead. Uh. I'm not letting her stand in my way. I've made up my mind I'm not staying here. What was I thinking? She's right. Nothing to return to. No life worth living. Being dead is the only thing I'm good at. 
least in here, if I can make a difference. Is that who I really am? Is she what I've been running away from? I don't want that to be a part of me. I don't want anything to do with her. I'm not going over this again. I've made up my mind. I'm going home. Mm, do I want to be forceful or do I want to be, like, really forceful? I'm doing this. I'm going home. Home. Sure. Why not? Why not go home? Easy. Oh, but wait. Your father lied to you. Your mother tried to kill you. You put your friends in danger and you lost every single one of them. Everything and everyone you ever cared for is gone. Right, so I'm a loner now. You're right. That sounds like the perfect home to return to. Maybe she's right. Maybe she's not. Me. Us. Whatever this is. Part of me agrees with her and part of me just wants to find out for sure. We, we can't know what's waiting for us on the other side, but so what? That's life. Full of surprises. I like the sound of that. I'm not even going to look at the other ones. Maybe. Maybe not. I'm going to find out for certain. <laughs> nice retort, big sister. Did you rehearse that one? What did you call me? Touch a nerve, did I? That was you. You were there. You said goodbye to Faith. It's not for you to mock and use against me. That was never me. You left me behind before that. You ignored your true self and pretended to be a hero. Like that was ever going to stick. No. Not a hero. A grown-up. Unlike the whiny bitch I used to be. Oh! But, you know, that's okay. I accept who I was. I accept you. Oh, spare me the bullshit. You're lying to yourself. You don't want anything to do with me. I'm ready to embrace who I was. Who I am. Who I will be. Oh yeah? And... And who is that? Aw, oh, crap. I used to know where my life was supposed to be heading. But I'm not sure that's where I want to go next. And that's fine. I'm ready for a change. I used to know where my life was supposed I used to know exactly what I wanted to do with my life. There was certainty in that. I don't know why I lost faith in who I was and who I wanted to be, but it's time to find my way back. You can't go backwards, so you can only go forward. I used to know where I don't know yet. You're a part of me now. You always will be. We need each other. Come on. Life's waiting out there. Let's find out what's happening. Uh, Houston, we have takeoff. My name is Zoe Castillo. And I'm alive. It's like the Jon Snow scene when he gets brought back to life. Like, <gasps> I'm alive again! But now... Just... We're... We're in heaven! Hi guys! Welcome to the world of white. Where everything is... Wh oh, okay, welcome to chapter two! Haha! <laughs> 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 Chapter 2, Awakenings, alright. Three months later. My, time does fly, but then we can control time, can't we? Oh. Good evening, Warden. How do your prisoners fare? Commander, all is well. If you like, I could show I'm you... I'm not here to inspect your prison, Warden. I'm here to speak about one prisoner. Ah, oh, your apostle. Alvane. He's an apostle no more. He was a tool, but he lost his edge. He's no longer of any use to us. No. It's time we put all of this behind us. Would you care to translate, Commander? I'm afraid my ability to read between the lines is somewhat lacking. We want Kian Alvane's execution to be... hastened. I see. I, I thought your six would need to judge and condemn Alvani before... When did you become an expert on Azadi law, Warden? 
Well, I'm not, sir, but we have laws and regulations of our own, Commander. I was told that Kian Alvani would be sent to Sadir to and stand... I am telling you to carry out his sentence. Tonight! What? Uh, uh, impossible. Uh, I, I need to call in the executioner How and, soon? Well, by first light, at the earliest, but still... First light, then. But what about the paperwork? I mean, the proper documents, signed and stamped. This goes one of two ways, Warden. Either you do what you're told, and execute Kian Alvani by first light. Or you find yourself hanging right next to him when the sun kisses the top of Friar's Keep tomorrow morning. How it plays out is entirely up to you. You have your orders, Warden. Barbarians. Oof. I have only one memory of my mother. She held me close one night and sang an old song from her country. I don't remember the melody, but I remember the words. Sleep, child, sleep. Sleep in your mother's heart. Let the wind blow and the rain fall. Hear the executioner's call. Watch the traitor's head roll as the shadow takes his soul. Oh, what a great song. Sleep, child, sleep. We shall never part, for we will soon be free, together forever in the cold, cold sea. Ah, oh, Alvani, you are here. Good. Where else would I be? I hear you uh, turned down your last meal. Hmm, pity. I personally approve the menu. There were, uh... <clears throat> Sausages. Why would the warden come to visit me now? What could he possibly want? I have nothing to say to him. I won't give him the pleasure of hearing me speak. What good will it do? He wants me to plead. I shall not. Well, I don't think he wants you to plead because we already uh, know a little bit of what went on. So since we already have a bit of backstory, I will talk Why would him. the Warden... If you've come to see me beg for my life, Warden, you won't... Oh, no. Uh, no, 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 no. You're a rational pragmatist, Alvani, quite like myself. No, I am merely here to ensure that you are prepared for hmm, the next step. As you know, your execution will take place at dawn. I have to mm, admit that I'm, I'm curious why, after so long, there's such a sudden rush to see you dead. I'm very curious. But uh, <clears throat> that's not why I'm here, no. As you also know, you have the choice between hanging and beheading. As far as I can tell, you have yet to um, voice a preference. If you forfeit this choice, it'll be left to me to decide the uh, <clears throat> instrument of death. I simply want to ensure we dotted every I and crossed every T. Uh-huh. Interesting. Um... Okay, quick and painless. A warrior, take my head. The sword it is. I shall make a note of it. <clears throat> Do you have no family, Alvani? My family is very important to me, almost as important as my duty to this city and this office. In the event of my own death, it would pain me to know that they would be left with no answers. No body to bury, no closure. I, I know you're a man of faith, a man of principle. I also understand that things happen to hmm, make you question your calling. What I do not understand is why you've... Um, <clears throat> Simply decided to give up. To... Mm, to stop fighting. I'm liking this warden. I know he's got to do his job and everything, but for right now, I'm liking him. Um, How can he understand? How can anyone? To have everything you believe in fall to pieces. To be asked to continue a war that you have no faith in. 
by commanders that you can no longer trust. I trust I trust the warden. I'm going to I'm going to talk with him about this. You would not understand. Try me out, Varney. You may come to see that we're more alike than you thought. No. I have no family. No country. Nothing to fight for. So leave me be. And let me prepare for death in peace. Very well. Everything has been uh, properly filed. I have no reason to question the order of execution. Even threatened me with dismissal and worse, should I stand in the way of their orders. They don't know me very well. Threats mean nothing. Proper paperwork, on the other hand. Well, I will simply have to <clears throat> accept that my questions will remain forever unanswered. I shall see you at first light, Alvani. The sword will be ready for you. Heck is going on? Is there a riot out there? Get up, Kian. Oh! There isn't much time. Uh, hi? Alright. Bloody time. Come on. We're going. Let's go. Yeah. What's okay. going on? No time for answers. Let's get a move on. You're, What's going on down you're there? You're part of that resistance. That boy is a made to order riot. We're getting you out of here. Who are you? Do I know you? I bloody well hope so. You were this close to running me through with your sword. What? A swamp city? Precisely. Where I made a daring, swashbuckling last minute escape, and you were arrested by your own commander. Quite a day, eh? If you're with the resistance, why are you helping me escape? so that you can repay your debt and help free our city. In the meantime, we need a bloody key to get through this bloody gate. Need a key? Okay. Um... I can run. Oh. Hey! Hey! Help me! He's still breathing. I've seen him around the prison. I don't think he's been here that long. And I don't hey, think you. he's long for this world. Over! <coughs> he's still breathing. Over here! I've seen him around the prison. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm aware of this I fact. I want to help him. Long. And I don't think he's long for this world. Uh... He might know how to get out of here. I don't think he'll make it, but... If he can help us, his death won't be in vain. He looks badly hurt. I don't think he'll survive long. But we can't just leave him here either. Yeah, I I don't know if we can take him you out, so I'm gonna. Know. Do you know how to get through that gate? The guard. He, <coughs> he he has a key in his pocket. That must be. Is there anything I can do for you? Anything at all? My <coughs> my family. Tell them. Tell them what happened to me. Tell them I love them very much, and that. <coughs> My children, tell them they make me proud. Okay. I have to pro I promise. They live in the bones. My name is Stant. Arn Stant. Thank you. They live in the bones. We gotta remember the bones, people. Alright, you. It appears to be a gate key. It probably unlocks this first gate. You know, you're probably right. Aren't stunt. I am so sorry. Um, if, if we just leave him like that, I can't murder an innocent man. I won't force you to, Kian. You have the key. Excellent. I'm not now murdering him. Gate. We will need a key to open this gate. I'm aware. Of this. We will need a key to open this gate. Oh, that's right. I got to I'm an idiot. All right, you use the key to unlock the gate. I got it. You do know how to use a key, don't you? Yes, I do. We have different keys for every floor, so you might as well leave that one in the lock. Follow me, boy. We're going up, not down. I'm not following you. I'm going up myself. You follow me. Upwards. The is growing. Ever upwards. Moving closer. We need to keep moving up. Find a way out before the keep becomes smoking rubble. So are we actually going to get a chance to meet that guy's family, do you think? Oh, 
Okay. Way out of here is up, up, up. You're just gonna keep talking. Okay. Anything here we can use? Must be another guard around here somewhere. What did you mean, repay a debt? You damn near wiped us out, boy. Your last minute reversal didn't help save anyone, aside from your own soul, mayhap. And now is your chance of repentance. I don't want repentance. I'm ready to die for my crimes. Why don't you just leave me here? Well, you're ready to die, kid. Resistance certainly isn't. And we need you. Now, find a way to open this bloody door. Something long and thick. Okay. Can I talk to this guy? Locked. The riot hasn't reached this floor yet. Yeah, I know, but he Most wants... Most of the prisoners wants, are still under lock and key. He wants in. Locked. And I don't have time to pick each and every cell door. I don't even have anything to do it yet. Alright. Um... Hello? Anything in here I can use? I don't see anything. Okay. Let's keep going. Let's get stuck on a bucket. You're fine in there? Okay. I yeah, okay. That's fine. Um... Hmm. Something long and thin. Can we call the speaking tube? Hello? Nope. Okay. I'm trying to remember, didn't we, uh... I thought... Ooh. So many barrels. Do they never clean up after themselves? Apparently not. Um, weren't we in this prison as Zoe? I I have no time to spare, and no desire to let all these prisoners loose. You're fine in there, good. You, you can stay in there then, I won't do anything to force you out. Uh, it's like this is open for a reason, and yet I'm apparently blind. Why am I blind? Uh, that was an interesting... Oh, 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 wait a minute. Window? There he is, up there! Oh! He got away! The keep is surrounded by soldiers. Mostly Azadi troops, it looks like. Good bowmen. I'm lucky I dodged their arrows. Yeah, I wasn't exactly expecting that. Sorry, Kian. Last thing I want is for you to be dead. Ooh. What's under here? Why do I have a pillow? Was was there a purpose for me having this pillow? What? Okay. We 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 have a pillow. Cool. Oh, wait a minute. What about this broom? Will this broom be able to do anything for us? Yeah. Okay. Use one item on another to come. We have a live one here. Let's find out what he knows. Where are they going? Tell us! Tell us or we'll make you suffer! No. Don't. Please. They're torturing him to death. May the goddess lead his soul to the first mountain. Oh, that's that guy. Dang it. You know what? Nope. 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 This will not stand. Oh, are you kidding? Are you... We need to get up there now. Dang it. Where are they going? Tell us. Tell us or we'll make you suffer. No. Don't. Please. <laughs> Shoot. Combine. Use the combine. What the heck is that going to do? A 
pillow on a broom. What's a pillow on a broom gonna do? We need to get up there now. Where are they going? Tell us. Tell us or we'll make you suffer. No. Don't. Please. What do we do with this? Can I light the pillow on fire? Perhaps? No. No. Okay. Can I help him? We need to get up there now. Where are they going? Tell us! Tell us or we'll make you suffer! No. Don't. Please. Uh, I don't know what to do. Is there anything else I can look at? <gasps> Wait a minute! I have an idea! What if I take and put the pillow out the window and get one of the arrows stuck in it? We need to get up there now. Oh, shoot! Tell us. Tell it. Oh, I'm a genius. We got him! I think we got him! And thin enough to fit in a lock. Ah. We should be able to open the gate with this. Yes! Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. We're... Okay, it's the guy that wants to fight. I want to help him out. We need to get up there now. Where um... are they going? Tell us. Tell us, or we'll make this. Not suffer. everyone in here no. is a wrongly convicted rebel. Don't. Some are violent Please. murderers. I won't risk it. Oh, okay. I'm feeling more. Dis Finish him off. He's of no use to us. You only have yourself to blame. Was it right of me to leave him to that fate? I swore to never kill again, but I'm not sure it can ever be that simple. I must at least fulfill the promise I made to him and bring word to his family. Absolutely. We will absolutely do that. All those years on the streets that of Sadia are paying off. Someone the riot won't last case. forever. Me. Something's going to give. Either the watch kills every last man, or the prisoners tear this place to pieces. I mean, yeah, I could have done help that guy out and ended his suffering. Let's move. They've broken through to the floor below. Oh. Hello, warden. You gonna let me in? Why, if it isn't our old friend, Mr. Murren. I'll say back him. I should have known you wouldn't have let yourself get caught so easily. You're damn right. Now let us through. I'm afraid that's uh, quite impossible, Balse. Your journey ends here, I'm afraid. There's no pick in this one. He's plugged it from his side. By the Mojo's unclean genitals, Warden! Open up right this bloody minute! Words, 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 Mr. Bakim. You know very well I do not respond to threats. When I get my hands on you, Warden, you will wish your grandmother had never spread her legs to your this grandfather. Is, uh, <clears throat> as far as you will get. People. Claims I'm to going to reason with him. Pragmatic. Listen. Do you hear that? Your prisoners are revolting, Warden. Sooner or later, they will reach this floor. Let me through, and I shall be lenient and merciful. They won't give you the same consideration. I see. And what, pray tell, is my guarantee that you'll follow through on your <clears throat> promise? Um... He will need to trust me. Even though I may not be able to stay my anger, he's responsible for many innocent deaths. But if I can convince him to believe me, mm. doesn't the warden claim to be a practical man? If that's the case, he would listen to a practical argument. I will just have to phrase myself carefully. He's not likely to fold easily. He will have to take my word for it. After all, what choice does he have? And I'm... I was the Apostle. I was always true to my word. Garmin and Atana taught me well. Why should he not trust me? We're gonna appeal to his practicality. Doesn't the Warden think carefully about this, Warden? My leniency is your only hope at this point. Hmm, perhaps. But as you may imagine, I didn't rise to my position by taking people at their word. 
particularly in a prison. Honesty is in <clears throat> short supply in here. Okay. I really have no time for chit-chat. We're running out of time. And this filthy heathen is the only thing between us and freedom. I won't mince words anymore. No. All men of his station can be bought. No. He said his family is important to him. If he fails to respond to threats to his own life, maybe no. he'll listen. What did he say about family again? He may treasure his office above his blood. Yeah, let's do that. You are a family man, Murren. Are you not? Do you wish to see them left fatherless? If not for yourself, then do this for your family. Open up. Hmm, my family is important to me. I would not want my boys to grow up without a father. Their mother <clears throat> lacks the moral fortitude needed to instill duty and backbone in them. Let's forgive her. She's a good woman, but merely a woman. Very well, you make a fair point. I will trust you despite my better instincts. Yes. Step back, Alvani. Praise your gods, I don't have time for you now, Murren. But your day will come. Can I? You gave me your word, Alvani. Your word? You said I would not be harmed. Are you kidding? You said you would no. let me live. No, 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 no. You will receive your just punishment soon enough. Like, <coughs> all that for... Perhaps so, Alvani, but at least my punishment... <coughs> at least my punishment will be at the hands of those who respect laws and regulations. And not a... Be a barbarian like yourself. You know, I gotta <coughs> side with Muron on this one. I mean, we did all that reasoning with him and then we put our hands on him? Come on. Seriously, Alvani? That was rather disappointing of you. Okay. This is as far as the stairwell will take us. Now we need to find a way to the roof. I didn't say I wanted to leave this place. What part of to be executed in the morning did you not get? And what part of the resistance needs you did you fail to comprehend? Why would your people trust me? I am their enemy. <laughs> you were the enemy. I trust your allegiance to your people has diminished somewhat in the past year. How do you know I won't just turn on you as soon as we're out of here? Oh, I know. And others do too. Our faith is rarely misplaced. Uh-huh. I can't look at the napkin? Or the candle? Okay. Guessing I'm gonna have to look at them at some later point. I can't run. I can only walk. Okay. Um. Guess just go around and see what there is. Yep, I'm just walking now. I can't even sprint. Open this goddamn door right bloody now. No. Unshackle me and let me join the rebellion. You know, there was somebody else down there that said the same thing, and apparently that's a bad idea. Alright, 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 alright. So I just literally made a circle. Okay. So what now? There's no way up, so we're gonna have to climb up through one of these cells, perhaps? Oh, there's a lever. Can't use the lever. Can we use this? There's nothing we can use. Are you kidding me? What are we supposed to do? Captain, I'm going to talk with you. Because I don't have a clue what I'm supposed to do. Give me some, give me some help here. No? Nothing. Okay. Oh, are we just walking together? This passage leads up to the roof. Oh. But the gate's twice locked. There's, there's no, no way through, through here. We need to find another way up. <laughs> Did they just say there's no way through here. there together? Now you need to put that Azadi brain of yours to work. And quick. 
right. What's going on out there? Huh. Wish I knew. Yazadi are entrenched. They're up to something. There ain't been a lot of new troops arriving. But then again, they've stopped pushing north. They only appear interested in holding the city. Saya and Vermon are still in charge. Oh, uh, they're in charge, all right. But rumors say one of the bloody six is arriving soon. Which is why we need to be ready. Something's about to go down. Hmm. Sorry, I didn't expect we you were We don't gonna... have much time. I'm sorry, there's always time for a water break. Now I can run. Okay. With Rue. All right. we need to These stop torches him. should have be damned. The guards are getting closer. We'll get him, sir. You just stay here. My napkin. Take. Okay. Napkin. Oh. I still have the arrow. Can I combine this with this? I can. And now... Where's the key? Light it. Shut up! I need a stronger flame to light this torch. Oh, okay. Let's use this one, then. It won't catch the flame. Like the wise man of Ozad once said, the moist napkin makes for poor kindling. Hmm. Oh. Wait a minute. Where's the key? Any oil Someone around here? Keys. Any oil? Oil. 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 Bucket? Do you have anything in your bucket? Oh, no. Um. Um, wait a minute, hold on, there's something in one of these, wait, what was that, what was that, I don't know what it wanted me to see, what about in these barrels? Where's the key? The slop we Someone eat three times a day arrives in these barrels, the stench makes me sick. Yeah, but what if we can take and puncture it? No, no, okay, worth a try, um... Plate? What do we need a plate for? I draw the line at licking the plate clean. I'm hungry for red meat, but I'm not a dog. Yeah, well, the key? It's like oh, there. Fire, do we need no. that for something? I can't get to clear shots. Don't fire Shadow, at me. They're firing. It's a speaking tube. I'm aware it's a speaking tube. I want to. Anyone talk. there? Okay. I'm speaking into a metal tube. They use this contraption to transport food from the kitchens below. Yes, they do. They use this contraption to transport the food from the kitchens below. The clamp chain goes cage. up to the mechanism that raises and lowers the cage. It's covered in thick oil. <gasps> yes! You. From a broken arrow and an oiled ah. face towel, I've fashioned a rudimentary illuminant. Yes! In other words, I have a torch. Yes, you do. You just had a roundabout way of saying it. Now we got it. Where's the key? Someone I'm get the goddamn key! Where this is going. You know what? Me too. I have no idea what we're doing, but. There's no way through here. There's no way through here. Huh. So, what do we have a torch for? Can we light stuff on fire? Can we light this on fire? No. Where's the key? Someone get the goddamn keys! What can we light on fire? Can we do something with the plate? I draw the line at no. licking the plate clean. I'm hungry for red meat, but I'm not a dog. Um, they use this contraption to transport aware. food from the kitchens anymore? below. Oh, shoot. Oh, clever boy. I knew the you wouldn't disappoint off. me. The oil burns off. Still warm, first. but it's cooling quickly. Still hot. I want some warning. What? I should be able to climb the chain now. Oh, we're climbing it. Right behind you, boy.
guided the sword for you. A warrior's death. What are we doing here? Where's our cloud ship? We need to buy ourselves some time. Quick, lock that gate. Use the lever to lower the bar. Quickly now.